Shine up ahead, it's here and happening. So be ready. Now it begins.
So it's time to take down this big maple. It's dying, the top's broken, there's a bunch of dead limbs, some are hung up. It's pretty dangerous, it keeps dropping those limbs. So one of my goals for this trip was to get this tree down and it'll be good firewood for later on. I'm just tired of working around underneath it with it dropping limbs and it being a hazard. So time to get it done. A little bit of snow here will help cushion the fall and the ground's still pretty firm. So now's the time to do it. <clears throat> and you can tell that it has, it's pretty lopsided and it's leaning that way. So it's gonna go this way. I'm going to try to persuade it to drop down in the road. That'll be the best case scenario just because I'm trying not to damage any of, the, any of these other trees or get it hung up. Well, didn't need to use my wedge, and that came down pretty good. Really can't ask for much of a better outcome. Pretty pleased with that. It's awesome. Here's what I ended up with. Got this tree down. I kept three 
log lengths because it's a nice spalted maple and I might try to mill some of this maybe I can use it to make a rustic table for the cabin or something I have a nice pile of firewood pile of firewood firewood I'll have some raking to do when the snow is gone burning all the limbs it smells awesome it smells like a sugar house because the saps flowing I'm glad I got that tree down and started to get it processed all that firewood it's going to need to season but it should be ready by the fall for to burn in the new cabin so that's awesome there's a couple things I noticed down here at the river that I wanted to show you some evidence that there's been beavers and I think I heard them splashing and they must have they must be working on something upstream. The other thing I noticed over here that wasn't here uh, in the, when I left last year, there's been a moose that's walked down to the river and come through here. So that's cool. Uh, I like to see the wildlife around the cabin i've already heard been here two nights i've heard the owls and all kinds of birds and it's just nice to get back and to hear all of those sounds the sound of the river itself and everything it's what i love about being out here but that was a good couple of days getting back here getting set up i still need to grade out the bridge but I'm gonna pack up and get out of here I'm really tired and I'll take care of that next time and I'll be working on tearing down what's remaining of this old shell of a cabin because there's no point in keeping it around and that's where the new cabin is going to be